Alright, hopefully it's live now, I guess. So, yeah, cool. I, I feel guilty because I literally, like, <laughs> when I turned on OBS today, it said, like, do you want to update to this version? I was like, please, please update to this version. And I was just like, no. <laughs> no. I don't have to. I should have. So this is the problem. I literally never know which hole it is. I don't know how. Every single time I play this game, I don't know which hole it is. I think it's like something weird like it's like part of this one. Oh, it's the other part of this one. That's what it is. Okay. Hopefully I'll remember that then for next time I play this game. Oh, it's the middle of this one. Sure. <laughs> right? Yes, there we go. Jeez. Okay. Oh, and they gotta kill one of these guys. It's like... I think they maybe want you to use the spin drill as a weapon, but you don't have to. But you also have to get a little lucky. I don't remember... what the right way to do it really is. Do you have an ad break? Sorry, Bran. I wonder how much money I make from ads. It, I last I checked, it was almost, if not nothing. Oh, there it is. Fi the last Mecha Koopa. Okay. Also, it's pretty funny. Those are just straight up called Mecha Koopas. There's no other name for them, which is pretty interesting since that's a really they look really different from the traditional Mecha Koopas you're probably used to seeing. Okay, cool. Spindrel's gone, and now it's flooded and cool. Oh, why are you doing that, Mario? Cool. Okay, so... I wonder how many stars you need to... Fight Bowser 1. Because it's about halfway through the run. If it were Gobble Percent. And I don't know how much longer World 2 is supposed to take. You know, I said I watched GDQ. But by that I meant I, like, I watched it while I was like changing before I got in the shower. Oh, there's a penguin on here now. So yeah, I think doing that level was a mistake. Um, because it took a while. Definitely took a while. And... Yeah, I don't think that was really a good idea. So I think in the run, I would not do that. I think I would do the secret star. I didn't intend to do it, because I know that's a longer level. But it's fine. So, uh... I'll do the secret star here. And then I think I'll maybe do Fluzzard. I'm avoiding Boulder Bowl because I don't know how to do the cool thing. Because if I knew how to do that, it would be so definitely doing it. But yeah, I don't. Also, interestingly, with Boulder Bowl, you actually only do one. Uh, one star there. Because the second one is from the Guillermo who wants you to bring him a, a, a Goomba. So you can't do that one. You don't come back to Boulder Bowl until later. When he'll send you that in, the, like, I think World 4 or something. Should be where you are uh, when you get that, so. Yeah. Okay, so I need to get coins. And I, I don't know the right way to do it, honestly, at all. Well, my thing's gone, so I better have gotten coins. Okay, it's Star Bits only. Cool. Cool. Um, that was bad. So, there's a coop up here, right? Yeah. Okay, cool. Thank you, Stream Elements, again. You don't need that many coins for this. It's like 10. The Hungry Luma is not that hungry, but... I'll see. I remember that it, when you're trying to do it, you're trying to get this thing. And I guess, like, this... Is it actually maybe 10? It might be. So let's hope it's 10. And I'll just go up there. It is the start of the game. It's like one of the first Hungry Lumas. 15. Aw, oh, man. Alright, that's going to be annoying. So, good to know that. This is... I don't know why I'm still getting upset about like time losses because it's a practice run. Very obviously. But uh, that sounds like me coping. Um, Oh, you can kill this guy. Uh... 
yeah, you can kill him, but I don't, I don't know why you would. <laughs> Wait, there's another, another one of those that's blocking something, but I don't think he's doing anything wrong. Whatever, I'll just, um, I'll have to find a nicer route of getting all these coins, because this is super messy and kind of choppy. Oh, there's a bunch over there. Yeah, I think he is too. Um, I have to say, I, I so I, this is actually one of the things I was going to make a video about, if I was going to make like a YouTube video. Um, so, um, can I get you? Oh, I missed him. That's fine. I can grab this coin right here, please. No. Ah. Mario, go down. Mario, become evil. Become red. All right. Are there coins here? Like, I'm at this point. I don't even care about my time whatsoever. Nope. Cool. So there's like one coin over here, right? Yes. Good. Um, Deep Dark Galaxy, I associate that level a lot with actually... Juan, are you still here? Do you remember... Um, if you are, do you remember Cloud from the Pokemon server? Because I remember he told me uh, one time... That he really, really likes Deep Dark Galaxy. We were talking about Mario Galaxy. And I just kind of, I kind of think of Cloud. I wonder how he's doing. Um. Yeah, this is a uh, Mario level. So you can, you can, um. Oh my god. <laughs> Carl, I thought you meant Peanut Butter Gamer. <laughs> like the, um. The way when I read that, I was like, I'm. <laughs> yeah, I know you meant Playbringer Goliath. <laughs> because he keeps killing me. I should have frozen it. What am I doing? Um. <laughs> I thought you meant like, like the normal boots, like. The <laughs> oh my god. PBG is, is a good one, though. Oh, shit. Or not, not PBG. Yeah, PBG the boss, not play... Peanut Butter Gamer. <laughs> okay. This is good game design. Shut up. Shut up, Brain. Don't be an op. Oh, no. This is bad game design. It zoomed in all the ice. Yikes. <laughs> I love PBG's theme, though. It's pretty good. Hi, buddy. I think I can catch you. I love this soundtrack because it's really... It's one of those soundtracks that can do everything, right? Like, there are some games that really do a certain type of music really well. Um, but not everything. This game literally does everything, right? Like, they can do the goofy tracks, like, this and, like, the minigame theme with the chimp. Really, like, I mean, this is obviously a song from Galaxy 1, 2, but um, I associate them both together because they're kind of, I mean, obviously they use assets. So, I mean, they can do, like, really, like, sad music that'll make you a little emotional really well, and they can also do awesome music. Like, I was listening, at the gym, when I was doing push-ups, I was listening to... Uh, Galaxy.